Hello, Elder Scrolls Online ESL Talk viewers. Today, it's different than all other episodes. Why? For the first time, maybe later too, we're gonna start bringing people that people hate or have a lot of controversial behind them. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I'll bring you Iconic Wavy. How you doing, Iconic? I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> Most... um, what can you tell us about yourself? Well, I'm one of the most hated people in the ESO. Uh, or controversial, I also used to be a leader of a guild called Iconic Order that was one of the most hated guilds in the game. And um, I've been playing ESO since day one release on the console and I've been playing it ever since but I've kind of taken a break so you might not see me lately I might be a little low in rank usually than I am than I usually am mm -hmm. but um other than that I'm mostly just a troll like most hated person in the so <laughs> one of the most hated how do you deal with drama like do you just let it go do you just put more into it like <laughs> See, it's funny because the thing about it is that a lot of the beef that so-called people re say revolves around me or like orbits around me is not really beef to me. It's more so like ESO is a game, so it's more so like entertainment for me. Mm -hmm. Like oh. when it, when it when it happened, like when beef happening, mm -hmm. like I might say stuff and I wouldn't even like I would like people would call me a nigger and like I don't know if I, <laughs> the N word. He would call me the N word, and I wouldn't even care, man. Like it's a game at the end of the day. I mean, mm -hmm. sometimes you saw me getting like little debates about the black race and all that kind of stuff, and I know my stuff a, a little bit, but it's not really. At the end of the day, I'm going to sleep. You know, it's not really that serious. It's just mm -hmm. a game at the end. Yeah, once you so turn really the system the off, game. everything goes away, right? Yeah, even in real life, man. Like I wasn't really mean in real life, but. I wasn't scared of people. Like I'll hold my ground and stuff like that. I wasn't no little kid that you like kid that you could push around and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. It was. I'm just a chill person. Like I never did even get in beef in on um, ESO. Like in the day one, I was solo. Mm -hmm. Like I was solo my whole time on here. I ran Emperor solo. I was like, a lot of people even try to say I boosted for Emperor, but I didn't even boost for Emperor because when I got Emperor, I was in School of Corruption, so I wasn't really with a Zerg. I think I did call Legends of Daggerfall because I was friends with um. Oh my Mikey God, Mike Seven, Seven the like, boss. Um, yeah. Shout out I to Mikey him, if like, he's watching. Come in. <laughs> yeah, I had Asuna come in and um help me get it, and later on Daggerfall came to school. But other than that, I had got up number one on leaderboard myself. It was just that it was no Daggerfall in that campaign because they were scared because mm -hmm. EP and AD ran it, so I just got it like that. What uh? What a, what got you to play this game? Are you? Did you play the previous Elder Scrolls, or is this, was this your first Elder Scrolls game? It, this was my first Elder Scrolls. This this was my first MMO. Like before ESO, I was like a, one of them Call of Duty kids. When I came to PS4, that's when COD started turning the shit with Advanced Warfare and all that kind of stuff. So then I decided to go with like try something new, and I saw ESO, and I'm like, oh, that shit look cold as hell with all the alliances <laughs> and all that in the PlayStation Store. So I, yeah. down, I like pre-ordered it, and when it came out, I played it, mm -hmm. and I and I couldn't turn back. It was like the best game I ever played. Just got it like that. Mm. Any message to uh, any uh, new players who are starting ESO? Uh, don't put your stress or don't put all your like don't rely on anyone else. Like if you want to get good at the game. I'm not saying I don't have any friends on ESO, but you might want not start out. I'm not gonna necessarily say solo but you want to play the game a little bit by yourself mm -hmm. unless you're running in with like friends in real life and you all know that you're going to be a group for the rest of the game then i can understand it but if you're coming in the eso like as a new player and nobody else you really know you might want to just stick to yourself make friends but mostly stick to yourself like don't rely on those zerks or anything like that to carry you in pvp you want to 
put yourself in those situations where you're fighting like 10 people at once or fighting two people by yourself because that's how you get better. Mm -hmm. And don't be scared to duel. Thank you for coming here, Iconic. I'll put your uh, oh. your uh, YouTube channel down in the description so anyone can check your videos out too and subscribe. Uh, I just want to say thank you guys for watching this video. Give me a like or dislike or super dislikes. <laughs> uh, I'm a little bit scared of this episode, but we'll see what happens. Um, we'll see you guys next week and we'll see who we'll bring here and we'll see. Thank you. GG, I, I finally got to kill your bitch ass at least, man. Damn. All right, I'm out.